guys, so today I'm gonna be reacting to everyone has that weird kid in school. So yeah, let's just get right into the video. I remember in fourth grade walking into the bathroom to see the weird kid jumping up and down with his pants at his ankles, pissing everywhere with a eating grin on his face. The mental image haunts me to this day. So he was just peeing everywhere in the bathroom? Wait, eating grin? So I'm assuming he ate poop? Or something? Or was it because his grin looked really crappy? <laughs> I don't know. Ugh, if he ate poop... Ew. Yeah. There is always that one weird kid. Dude was in love with Misty from Pokemon. Like one of the bullies made him cry by insulting her. This was in high school. What? He cried because someone insulted Misty from Pokemon? Someone insulted a cartoon character and he started crying. <laughs> that's pretty funny to be honest. I mean, yeah, that's like anyone insulting something that you like. Obviously, you're gonna get defensive, okay? But this was in high school though. Oh. One day in language arts, some random dude said something about glue and then he got up, screamed, got glue, and then hopped around the floor on his ass screaming for four minutes until he was forced out of the room. Got glue? <laughs> Yeah, do you have glue? I need glue right now. I need to make some slime, okay? <laughs> oh my gosh, why did he want glue? Eating a complete salad out of a briefcase while sitting in the bleachers during one of our high school's football games. Out of a briefcase? Maybe they lost the lunchbox and the only thing they could find was a briefcase. Dang, that must have been a huge salad, you know, a briefcase. Dude used to get fruit from the cafeteria and slam them into the toilets. Like he would just stand in front of the bowl and throw oranges in as hard as he could. <laughs> what? I'm assuming he was... Maybe he thought that was basketball or something. <laughs> what the hell? He would throw it in the toilet bowls? What a waste of fruit. Can you imagine if someone is just in the next cubicle and all they hear is screaming and loud plunks into the water. I would have just thinking someone is like pooping real bad. We had this really odd girl who wouldn't talk to anybody but would instead hiss at them if they got too close to her. She would hiss? How, how do you hiss at people? Maybe she hated everyone at that school. Humped the drain pipes and tried to kiss the teachers. Okay, now that is a weird kid. What? Why? What? I am concerned. Oh my gosh. I, I'm just imagining this person chasing every teacher and every teacher is just trying to run away, you know? <laughs> when playing cricket while sitting down, queuing to bat, he'd just sit there eating grass and get mad when he had to field because it would interrupt the grass eating. He was just eating grass? Ew. Ew. I mean, that's dirty. I mean, why grass though? Why grass? Maybe he was secretly a cow. <laughs> he would get angry. He was like, why do you have to disrupt my grass eating? How dare you? Can't you see I'm having my meal? I'm eating lunch right now. After classes ended, he would full sprint to the buses. He also wore a black trench coat every damn day. I live in a very warm place where the temps in summer are high 80s to 90s. And in the winter, it usually hovers around the 50s at the lowest. So it was strange. Oh... I guess that is pretty weird. Maybe he's just always cold. And I guess he would sprint to the buses really quick because he hates school. <laughs> he just wants to go home, you know? I mean, I feel like that was everyone. Like, everyone just wants to go home after school. Eating a whole wooden pencil. Just bit it and chewed and swallowed like it was nothing. Ow! I mean, how do you eat wood? Like, the splinters and everything? Ouch. Ouch. He chewed it? He chewed lead? Why? Oh, that's nasty. This one's a bit different. There was this nerdy kid who rarely spoke, but people would always pick on him and just be excessively rude in general, though he never did or said anything wrong. During the first week of my junior year, my English teacher had everyone go around the room and introduce themselves with a word that they think best describes them. I'll never forget what he said when it was his turn. Misunderstood. I think people have the wrong idea of who I am. I'm really not like how you guys portray me. I can still remember it clearly. The look on his face and the tone of his voice was heartbreaking. Misunderstood? That's the only word he used to describe himself? That's so true, like... Nowadays, 
I mean, seriously, people in general just love to judge. Like, I feel like it's just natural for people to start judging, but it's so bad because sometimes we don't even realize that we're judging people. One of the fluorescent lights was going out and occasionally flickering. Everyone was doing some kind of individual quiet work. Between flickers, this kid would point his arms at the light, wiggle his fingers, and contort his face into this look of extreme exertion. Then it would start flickering and he'd relax. Oh my gosh, what? So he would like point his fingers to the light and the light would start flickering? No, he would point his fingers, make like, you know, this face to make the light flicker and then it would flicker. I always wanted to do that as a kid. <laughs> like seriously, I always wanted to move things with my fingers, just like lift things up in the air. How cool would that be? Sniffing everyone's hair and guessing the correct brand of shampoo and scent. Correct? Dang, this kid must have studied shampoos a lot because they guessed it correct. Oh wow. That is kind of random. <laughs> They'll just go around the class and just start sniffing everyone's hair. <gasps> Did they do this in public too? Oh man, I hope not. But seriously, this is talent, okay? Talent. If you mention any cheese around him, he will close his eyes, tilt his head towards the sky and yell, CHEESE! This would be me to be honest. <laughs> I would be that weird kid. <sighs> CHEESE! He put his feet up on his desk, suck air into his ass and fired it back out. One time he shut himself and ran off crying. So he did that all the time and just farted, but this time he pooped himself. Dang, <laughs> these kids though. Like, farting in public, people are embarrassed to do that, but he's like, no, I want to do that and I want people to know that I fart. Eating erasers. Oh yeah, there's always that one kid who always likes to eat the stationery, like pencils, erasers, like they'll just be biting at the end of it. Always that one kid. Eating gum from under the tables. That's nasty, why? So they're basically eating chewed up gum from other people and it's like old. Some gums have stayed under the table for like years because no one cleans the tables. Oh, that's nasty. Yuck. Oh. Well, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me in the comments down below what your thoughts are. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.